Uh, okay, so Wes, what movie uh, are you involved with? What was your involvement? I'm the writer, producer, and director of the short film, Seven to Seven. And what is that about? It's a psychological crime action drama. Uh, it's basically based on a series of short films. Yeah, that okay. centers around I'm like Kobe in the game. Cat. I'm going for 81. I'm trying to get this young money. Like Are you in the movie? No, I never did. What Talk inspired this movie? We, uh, club, we basically we just wanted to give you a, a different vision. Three, six, five, what people hear, assassin, they think, blood, gore, shooting, things of that nature. We wanted to give you a more psychological take into the world. We thought it'd be interesting. Step into the shoes. I'm taking all my chips. Go pay the bills with this. Well, it's more or less like what you know. What would the assassin think? You know, seven minutes before they actually the diamonds and pearls. You know, what do they do before they go to get their target together? Coffee, do they meditate? You know, you wanna, you wonder those things because every, you know, most of the people just like sex shooting, blood, guts. We wanted to get one. So it's, it's all her thoughts. You know, it's very nice little uh, twist. Her thoughts? Yes, she, Jack Spinks is a female assassin for the U.S. government. That can be a twist. Yes, it's a little, uh, it's got a little bit of sexiness to it. Um, very clever, and uh, I think a lot of people are interested. You know, this is such a wide open medium, uh, making independent movies. What drew you to it? Well, I mean, I've always been in the film. I've been a filmmaker for about 10 years now. I've been in the film. Uh, I came to the film festival with the National Film Expo in 2006, where I had the greatest choice of the film for the future. So, What's the name of that? It was called The Trailer. It was based on a novel by the show of Sire. So we adapted the novel to the film, feature film, and we actually premiered it, world premiered here at the one. It's a venue. And you know, you got to start somewhere. And you're not even a guy who started somewhere. You've been doing this for a decade. So, I mean, what what are your thoughts about this business of making independent movies? What, what's the validation for you? Well, the, the business has changed. It's changed a lot. That's why she you know, film is almost dead. Because I love them. You know, you got that. And that's real. I'm just you telling know, the new digital medium and things that go on I YouTube. Now, what's the deal? Uh, people are making films with iPhones. You got you know, they have wheel. actually festivals that are dedicated to iPhones. So I just think it's I'm with the changing media. Real. It's it's good and bad, but it opens up the field for people. Uh, people are getting discovered a little more. If you want to say discovered, I just think you just have to work hard, continue to work hard, remain consistent, persistent. What would make you happy in all of it? Uh, to be able to go sit down, watch my film, eat some popcorn, and have everybody cheer. And, that's it. <laughs> I just want to. I want to see my film out there, distributed. But I, I just love to do it. 